Yes, yes, I'm sorry. Uh, can you please give me the host no, back? So Miss Emma, please give me the host back so I can share my screen. Okay. Teacher, you, you are ready to host. Yes, yes, now I'm the host, okay. So uh, last time, last time, uh, one second. You take the last time. Uh, okay. So last, last time, time, yes, we took what? Very perfect. Remind me. Yes, Rowan. Uh, you. Hi, teacher. Hi, Malik. We make the between past simple and past perfect. Yes, perfect. The bravo, Ali Kirawan. Last session, we took <clears throat> the past simple tense and past perfect, and how we can differentiate between them, and how can we use both of them in the same sentence. So, who can give me example, guys? Me. Yes, Malik. I saw. Um, I had seen my mother uh, before. Uh, I saw my father. <laughs> okay. Excellent, Emma. Yeah, I, I had mother. seen my mother before I saw my father. Okay, perfect. I can see me? your screen. <coughs> Sorry? I can't see your screen, teacher. You can't see my screen? How come? Can't you see my PowerPoint, guys? No, miss, you can't see it. Okay, I try can. to change. Try to change your screen. I can. I, I can. can teach. I can okay. present. Yes. Oh, I think can the I... problem. Yes. Rowan, try to change your screen. Okay, who can give me another can example? Say, uh, uh, yeah, can me, can I? Raise your hand. Raise it's your hand. Me. Ask you. me. Raise your hand. I will I... ask you. Lean. Tell me, Lean. Okay. Lean. Okay. Give me example. Yes. An example for a past simple. And past uh, perfect. I went, I went outside yesterday. And an example for past perfect. I had played football since two hours. I had played football. Uh, okay, so please can you link between them? Sure, can I say Can I say can I say can wait, I say wait. it? My no, name no, is no, Muhammad. No, no, no. Okay. My wait. name is Mayan. Wait, I will ask you. Just raise your hand. Okay? Uh, Lean, can you link between the two sentences, please? Okay. Uh, before I uh, before I went outside, I had... What did I say? I had... Uh, I, well, I forget. What did I say before? I uh, played football, I think. Okay, okay. Yes, uh, before I, I went outside, yes, can I, answer? I, yes, can I, had, answer? I had played football. Yes, perfect. Yes, so can before, I my name is my heart. If and you talk without permission, I will not ask you. I said, raise your hand. And your friend here All was right. talking. The wait till your friend finished, then I will ask you. Okay. Um, excellent, Yelin. Bravo, Aliki. I will move to Rowan. Yes, Rowan, tell me. Miss, can I ask when I answer uh, because I raised my hand before? Yes, okay. So, Rowan, then I will ask him, Hamad. Yell, oh. Rowan. And my uh, after, I, after I had eaten my breakfast, I got, I got, I got to school. I went to school, sorry. Yes, <laughs> yes, excellent. Bravo, Aliki, Rowan. Okay, Muhammad. Yes, miss. I, ha yes, uh, I, I have an example. Okay, tell me. I had eaten my meal before I went to bed. Oh, great. Like it. Okay, Layan. Yes. <clears throat> Layan. I, miss, you I don't, don't know me. I will answer. I said, raise your hand. I will ask you. And I'm actually raise my you. hand. Okay, wait for your turn. Huh? Layan. Like, Layan. Muhammad. Muhammad, I asked you, Muhammad. 
Yes, he, you asked him, but you didn't ask me. I asked you, yeah, Muhammad. I said Muhammad. Right? You asked Muhammad, but you didn't ask my other. Okay. Okay. Layan. Yes, Layan. Yes, Layan. Layan. I had seen my book before I saw my answer. Again? <clears throat> I had seen my book before I saw my answer. Oh, yeah, great. Excellent. Okay, thank you. Yale Mayor? I had eaten my sandwich before I ate my pips. I drink. <laughs> <laughs> Before you drink your coca, right? <clears throat> yes. Yes, perfect. Excellent. Okay. Um, Jumana. I, I had go to school before I I play I play with my friends. <clears throat> I I had go or I had gone. I had gone. Yes, I had gone to school before. I played with my friend. Okay, Bravia Jumena. Fairuz. Yes. You raised your hand. Tell me your sentence. I, I, I had a, a, I had a Arabic session before, before the grammar session. Okay, uh, your sentence, yeah, Fairuz. I had a grammar session before the Arabic one. See, you didn't use the past perfect. You used both of them uh, past simple tense. So you need to use with had another verb in the past participle, as we agreed last session. So you need to say, I had taken grammar rule before I took my Arabic session. I had taken, I had taken past participle. I had taken my grammar rule <clears throat> before I took my Arabic session. Okay. Okay. Yes, perfect. Thank you. Hamza. Uh, okay, I say sentence. All right. I had written. Uh, uh, the homework, then I played football. Oh, excellent. I like it. Thank you. Okay, Yusuf. Yusuf Muhammad. Right, Sarah? I had packed my bag before traveling. You had what again? Packed my bag before traveling. I'm sorry again. I had had, or you said what? I had packed my bags before traveling. Okay, so you said I had had, uh, I didn't hear the rest before traveling. Yes, it's right because we can we can use after before the verb plus ing. So you can say before traveling, uh, after going, uh, instead of using the subject plus verb, you can just use the, the gerund, the verb plus ing. And you used had, had, which is perfect. This is past, past perfect, bravo aliki. Thank you, Sarah. Uh, Omar. Oh, you answered before. Okay, Maham, um, Omar, you didn't answer you, Omar, so, right? Right. Okay. Uh, so, uh, Muhammad, you have a sentence, Omar? Yes. Okay, tell me. I had played football uh, before I had my lunch. I had played football before I, I had my lunch. Yes, excellent. Nice. Okay, Mohammed Shadi. Yes, teacher. I had played tennis before I ate my breakfast. I eat or I ate Be before I ate. <laughs> yes, perfect. Before I ate my breakfast, yes, excellent. Bravo, Ali. Okay, thank you so much, guys. Um, I now have the... uh, an example. Who? Me, Muhammad. Muhammad. Another one, Muhammad. You mean? Yes. 
Okay, so this is the last one, and then we're gonna move to our room. Yes, Muhammad, tell me. I had breaking the cup before I entered the English session. All right, so you had drinking. What do you mean by drinking or breaking? Hmm. You want to use the verb drink, right? So can you please give me the third form of the verb drink? What, Miss? I can't hear you. Can you please tell me the third form of the verb drink? Uh, what is the third form? A drink? Huh? Drink. Sorry? Drink and then drunk. Drink? Okay, one second. I'm sorry, you closed your mic. Miss, we can't hear you. Miss, you're closed. The white is closing. Yes, yes, I'm sorry. So you said, uh, what is the, the, the third form of the verb drink, Muhammad? Uh, drink, uh, drink, and drink. Drink, drank, drunk. So you should say, I had drunk. I had drunk uh, my coffee or um, my cup, uh, which cup I don't know. It can be tea before I entered the session, right? Perfect. Yeah. Bravo, Alikim Hamad. Now let's move to our uh, rule, our new rule today, which is the future tense. And again, as I said, if we are going to talk about any tense, we need to talk about three things. What are they? Who can tell me? Uh, me. Okay, Malak. Uh, first, we need to talk about when I'm going to use this uh, this uh, verb. Or this Excellent. Tense. The usage, huh? And, and the form. The form. And uh, the time expressions. Excellent. Bravo, Aliki Malak. Yes. So we need to talk about the form, the usage, and the time expression. Mm -hmm. So we're going to talk about the usage first. When do we use future tense? I will move to um, Rowan, the next one. When do I use it, Rowan? Future tense, uh, we use it uh, when uh, something that happened in the future. Yeah, so if we are gonna talk about something that will happen in the future, right? Ritel, stop yeah. drawing on my screen, Ritel. Stop drawing on my screen. In the future. Okay, thank you so much. Perfect, Erwan. Anyone wants to add anything? Yes, hmm. me, teacher. Okay. Uh, it, uh, it's also talking about something uh, which uh, happens in the future and it can have an evidence or it can be a plan only. Yeah, great, excellent. Mayor, how about you? You want to add something? Mayor. Okay, so um, that yes, means go on. we are going to talk something will happen in the future. Yes, we're gonna about talk about action that will happen in the future. Or, uh, or we are predicting predicting something will happen in the future. Yes, perfect. Predicting something will happen in the future. Excellent. Who said that? Like next week. Yes, like next week. Who said that? Yeah. Or tomorrow. Yeah. Yes. Who said teacher? Okay. Yes. Sir, we know. Uh, I know that you the present sense of future and the meaning of it. We use an S. Well, I'm going to. Oh, great! Excellent, bravo, Aliki Feruz. Yes, we use well and going to, but this is you know, in the form. So stay with the usage okay. first. And we and we and we know this. 
we could get in grade three. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Okay, so when I say, I will visit you tomorrow, does it mean that I already visited you? No. No. I will visit you. Okay. Does it mean that I am visiting you now? No. No. Also. But, yes, perfect. So, but it means I will tomorrow to or next week. Yes. The action is didn't happen yet. So it will happen in the future, as you said. Perfect. Now, let's talk about the form. And I will move to Layan. Yeah, Layan. Yes. yes. Tell me about the form, Layan. What do we use to form um, future tense? What? What do we use to form future tense? Give me example using the future tense, Layan. Um, like, well, I had this. I had visited my friend. No, no. I, I will visit my friend the next week. Yes, perfect. I will visit my friends next week. So you used to hear well, sure. right? You said I had, then you changed your mind. You said, no, 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 I will. So the form we use or the verb we use is well to form the future tense. Perfect, Yelayan. Future, can I add something? Uh, yes, Yamalak. Uh, uh, when I want to write a... Uh, uh, a sentence in the future it will uh, the verb after will will be infinitive yes well plus infinitive perfect so when i use well what comes after the infinitive i will visit so visit is infinitive yes perfect I'm also going to. yeah perfect. i'm going to travel i'm going to yes so we use yeah. well <clears throat> yes can I say the keyword of the, of the future? No, no, no. We, we didn't reach this part yet. Wait. Right. So we use will and going to to express future. I will visit or I am going to visit. So with going to, I use verb to be. Am, is, or I am going to. He is going to. They are going to. So I will move to Mayor. Give me example in Mayor. About future. Your mic is muted, you Mayor. I will clean the house with my mother at tomorrow. Yeah, okay, perfect. So you will visit, you will clean your house with your mother tomorrow. Excellent. Bravo, Aliki. Um, okay, Yusuf. Hi. Hi, Yusuf. How are you? So give me some of Yusuf. Hmm. I will eat shawarma tomorrow. You will get what? <clears throat> I will eat shawarma tomorrow. You will eat something tomorrow? Shawarma. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you so much. Miss, for can, I, miss can I uh, give an example? My name is Muhammad. Uh, Muhammad what? Muhammad Kamal. Okay, yes, Muhammad. Uh, I will help you do your homework. I will help you do your homework. Okay, perfect. Yes, I will help you. Excellent. Okay, Muhammad Shadi. Yes, yes. Yes. I am going to uh, write my English homework. I'm going to write my English homework. Perfect. I like the usage of I'm going to. So please, guys, stop using well for now and give me more examples using uh, going to. Thank you. Thank you so much, Muhammad. Can You're welcome. Retail. Can I say an example? I want to say an example. Who? 
Me, I'm not a teacher. This, I have an example. Me, I'm a teacher. No, 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 no. I will not accept that. Wait for your turn, guys. I'm just at the door, Osman. Wait for your turn. Retell. I will study my homework tomorrow. I will study my homework tomorrow. Perfect. Okay, but try to use going to guys. Okay, I lean. Yes, teacher. Okay. okay, I'm going to travel Dubai next week. Oh, mashallah. Nice. I'm going to travel to Dubai next week. Okay, uh, Fairuz. Fairuz, tell me. We use the. I will. I will go. To no, no. I want. I want to going to Fairuz. You is going to. Okay. Okay. I am going to. I am going to the, I'm going to my friends and Friday and Saturday. I'm going to my friends on Friday, on next Friday. Yes, perfect. Probably if it was. Sure, I have a, a question, a question. Do you yes. have a question for me? Yes. Okay, wait, 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 All right, tell me your question. Uh, teacher, uh, is, is it uh, necessary to put uh, uh, a time expression in every sentence or not? Again? Uh, can I say uh, a sentence without a time expression? Give me an example. Like, uh, I am going to the countryside only. I think it will give me a hint that it is in the future. It is in the future. Yes, exactly. So when you say, I'm going to, um, I'm going to the countryside. So it's not, no, it's not a must here to tell me when exactly. If you are my friend, so I will ask you when. Okay. But, but it is common that you, that you say the time expression, for example, um, you can see it, it will be difficult for you, uh, or um, I want to say that it's normal for you always to say the time expression. Uh, I'm gonna leave tomorrow. Um, I will visit my friends next week. So, time expression, but it's not a must to say it. No, you can say, I will visit you, or um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move to a new house. Like, what are you doing right now? Right now, you are, for example, um, trying to pack your things because you're gonna leave to I'm a new going, house. I'm yes, so you didn't, you didn't say exactly when. And it's obvious. Some expressions, it was, sorry, with some tenses, we need to say the time expressions for a reason. As we said in the past simple tense, we need to put or to say the time expression here because to differentiate between the past simple tense and the, the present perfect, because both of them can have the same meaning or the same usage with the completed action in the past. And generally speaking, in speaking, not in writing, notice in speaking, people don't really care whether you use well or going to, or whether you use past tense or present perfect. They really yes, I can't okay. hear you. Can't you hear me? I can hear you, teacher. Yes. Yes, I think you have some problem. The one who's talking right now, maybe your, your connection or your headphone. So, I have a question. Yes. What is the difference between go to and will in meaning? Yes, yes. They don't have, um, you know, much difference in meaning. I will tell you, but wait for me. Okay, so, um, Jumana, it was Jumana's turn. Yes, see Jumana. Thank you, teacher. Tell me, Jumana, your sentence. My sentence. 
I will go to my grandma today. I will go to my grandma today, okay. Mr. Nelson? Um, who? Mayor. Yes, yeah, Mayor. I am going to the mall with my family tonight. Yes, I'm going to the mall with my I family tonight. Hear me. Can I say another sentence? Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Our no, mission, no. I can say, I, I will. One, one sentence I is enough to give your friend chance to answer. Uh, Mayor, one sentence is enough, Habibti, to give your friends uh, the chance to answer here. Uh, so um, I think this is Fairuz. No, yeah, Fairuz, it's your turn. Teacher, I answered. You answered, okay, Hamza. Yes, teacher. Give me your uh, okay, uh, I will go to school next month. Yes, perfect. Excellent. Ziad. Ziad and Fatma Zahra. Yes. Mom, can I answer? Yes, tell me. Teacher, sorry. Um, I am not going to Egypt. Oh, you use negative form. <laughs> You're not yeah. going to go to Egypt. Yes, okay. Thank you. <laughs> uh, perfect, perfect. Okay, Lean. Yelena. Yes. Yes, you sent it, I told you before, teacher. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, now we finish. So we use will and going to again to form to form um, future tense. And this is affirmative form. How about the negative form? Teacher, I have a very good sentence. Who? Me, Malak. You answered before, yeah, Malak. I didn't answer a sentence, teacher. You didn't give me a sentence before? No. Me too, teacher. Okay, tell me, Malak. Okay, but it me will too. be affirmative. No, put it in a negative form. Okay. We <laughs> okay. Will, uh, but it will be very good in an affirmative way. <laughs> Trust me, okay. teacher. Okay, say the affirmative and then put it in a negative form. Okay. We will study English two hours later. We will study English two hours later? Yes. Okay, put it back in negative form. We won't study English uh, <laughs> two hours later. Okay. I, I yes, will. perfect. Okay, Rowan. Thank you, Malik. Rowan? With you, teacher. Yes. Hmm. Uh, uh, I'm, not, uh, I'm not I'm not going to play tennis today. Yeah, uh, I'm not going to play tennis. Yes, I'm not going to play tennis. I will read for Okay, great. Uh Layan? A negative form, yeah, Layan? Teacher, I answer. A negative form. Yeah. Um, I will go to. I'm going to the mall at Saturday. Okay, I'm going to. This is not a negative form. This is affirmative. Put it in a negative form. I will go to the mall at. Saturday. I will read. Sorry. I will not. I will not go to the mall, or I'm not going to the mall. Right. I will um, read a story tomorrow. I will not read the story tomorrow. Okay, perfect. So we use not, we use not to form a negative form. Will not or am not going to, is not going to, are not going to. Okay, so let's have a look with our two, uh, uh, at our slides here. Um, Present. So, okay, so the present the symbol. Present? No, 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 no. He he wants to say that we use the present so symbol before yeah. to please. express. Please. No, no, wait, wait. Please. He's he's saying here that we use present symbol to express future in timetable. If you remember, we said we use present symbol to express future, but just only with timetables, right? And also we use present continuous to express also future, as we said before. And this is here, 
going to end well. And this is another shape to express future. We use will and going to. And your friend asked me here a very important question. Rowan asked me a very important question. She said, what is the difference between will and going to? Why do I have here will and going to? To express future. So who can tell me the difference between will and going me. to? Me, teacher. Another one. Just Malak, can, teacher, can I? I have one thing, but I don't know is it correct or not, but I will say it. Okay. 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 Uh, uh, I think that will is uh, something that will happen uh, in the future and in, but going to, uh, inshallah, and it will happen in the future. Yes, sheikh. <laughs> can I? Well, لازم تحصل, but going to maybe. Yeah. Teacher. Okay. Um, right. So can, we'll I can, I can I say it? Can I say the keywords? Okay. Um, okay. Miss, can I say a keywords? Or sentence? No, no, no. I don't, don't want on. examples. I sure, want you to tell me the difference oh. between well and going to. Sure, is the answer is the correct or no? Is it okay? Um, no, Yerwan, I'm sorry. Um, sure, can I see me, Lim? Lim, yes, sure, Lim. Can I answer, please? Wait. Next Friday, I'm going okay. to to the. Sure. Mayar, I said I don't want example, yeah, Mayar. I want the difference between going to and well. So I will listen to Lean now. Yes, Yaleen? Okay. okay. Uh, well and uh, we're going to, both of them are talking about future. But if I am sure, I'm going to use be going to, like a schedule. Okay. Like if I want to be talking about a, a traveling, that uh, means that I am uh, ordered set. So I'm going to use be going to. Like I am going to travel uh, to uh, Dubai. It means uh, that I have uh, prepared to that. So I am sure that I'm gonna to travel inshallah. But well, it means that it, uh, fast decision or yeah, it means that uh, something that is fast, like uh, uh, the, the phone is ring, the phone is ring, I'm gonna, to, I will answer, okay? Or yeah. uh, prediction like, the sun is cloudy, it will rain. It may, it may be rain or, or it may be not. Okay. Uh, all right. Rain. So you said- Can I add something? Yeah, uh, Lean, um, most of your answers are right, but not all of them. You have some mistakes. I will, I will fix them yeah, to you. But I, yes, uh, perfect. Bravo, Alec. I think you mixed things together, but it's okay. No problem. Uh, Malik, you want- Yes, Malik, is it you? Yes. Yes. That uh, going to like uh, it's something predicted, uh, and it has uh, it's planned. 